Okay, guys, we have another Hot Forms Tempo Medivh deck. Get rid of Medivh. We'll keep that. We'll get rid of Forbidden Flame. Uh, it's against a Warlock, so if it's Zoo, it's going to be very, very tough. Zoo is a uh, unfavorable matchup for a Tempo Mage, but we do have a couple of Flame Strikes, so it's going to be how good I can contain the Why early game. Uh, it's probably going to be very difficult to... We're going to do this. Get a some... Tempo going here. Alright. So it's going to be if I'm going to be able to contain the board. Uh, and Zoo's very tough for Tempo Mages. Just got done making the Druid, Ramp Druid. Uh, let's see what we have here. We have. We're going to put out here, stay on curve. Obviously, get rid of that. I just got done with the Ramp Druid um, Dragon Part 2, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. It was a loss, so my losing streak's over, but that's fine. Then I'm doing more uh, Mage because uh, I have the daily for two Mage wins. So hopefully we will get those two wins in one episode. If it takes too long, we'll just do one. Mm. Depend. Okay, so he's a dis, uh, dis, um, regard or discard... Uh, Alright, so actually, you know, to contain my board, I'm actually going, you know, I actually could do that, and then that'll be a uh, spell power, we'll actually give it, but well, let's do, okay, that's going to be three, that's going to be, if you put that down, that'll be two, reflect. no, doing the math here. Alright, so I'm off to a good start. That Forbidden Flame is a uh, good, good, uh, card it's very good flexibility see some play the first one a lot of people didn't think it was gonna be that good but uh give it power for flexibility so that's pretty good stuff all right so next turn we have the babbling book we have the cult okay, we gotta deal with that we're probably gonna have to trade Ooh. all right so we're gonna do this let's make magic I want to cast a spell. Now we're gonna see that. So we're off to a good start. He's at 18, we're at 30, so we have a good board. One thing about war uh, about zoo, when they lose the board and they're behind, they have a tough time regaining. So hopefully we will beat this space pope dude here. Uh, next turn we don't have anything to play. I guess we could technically freeze it. Alright, so he's going to lose a card. Alright, so Defender's actually pretty good. Alright, so let's see if we can get something going here. Um, the Fire Lord. So tempted to just uh, use it and roll my luck, but let's play it safe. Alright, so we got him in pretty good, pretty good position right now, so hopefully we'll get a win. Well, let's see he's Reno, but extremely oh, unlikely. Okay, so that. Alright, so that's okay. We're probably going to freeze him since we don't really have a good answer. Ooh, actually we do. Unfortunately, we're going to lose. You know, nah. We got rid of the death rattle, so he loses value for power overwhelming. But uh, let him do the trade. I don't know. Practice makes perfect. What is that? Oh, okay, actually, that's pretty good. The that's true. All right, so let's go ahead and see what we get now. We're probably going to play him on curve because we pretty much, we pretty much have close to. You know what? Let's do that. All right, so there's not really anything there. Uh, ping that. Obviously, we're going to have to trade. Next turn, we have Medivh. We'll most likely play him. Since he's at three, I don't know why he... Oh, he's giving up. Well played. Yeah, there's pretty much what we could do. Luckily, uh, we got the board and we didn't let go, so... 
That was a pretty decent game. Let's go ahead and try. Let's go, guys. I usually like to keep uh, about 10 to 15 minutes per episode. That's probably... that They say it's the optimal viewing. You're not too long, not too... Um, Short, okay, okay, not the same dude, but most likely Zeus. Yet again, we got to establish an early board, and hopefully we will uh, retain it. Let's get rid of that. So we do got early game, which is good. Oh, that's going to be really good one, but not anytime soon. I kind of don't like that in my opening hand. Um, let's put him, just in case we get a spell. Plus, he's going to be more difficult to remove. Now he coins something out, so that's not good. Oh yeah, we gotta deal with that because uh, he's obviously a he could potentially be buffed. So let's get rid of that. Uh, next turn we have uh, the apprentice and the book. And another one. It's not good. All right. Oh, not good. I need something earlier. At least I got the fireball for next turn in case that guy gets out of hand. Which he's probably going to have some synergy I right now. Oh, maybe not. Okay, that's good. He's probably going to trade uh, Mortal Kill. Well, that's actually excellent. So he clears my board. Oh, he's not trading. Huh? He's being a little greedy, a little bit aggressive, huh? Should make him pay for that. Let's go ahead and get spells we gotta get rid of that we're leaving that up there uh we do have uh oh, wow. several stuff next turn okay we're definitely gonna have to polymorph that get a little bit of a this guy has a much better start than our previous opponent so we need to sheep him yeah this one's gonna be tough hopefully we're getting close to turn seven so the more he fills up the board the better, I guess. <laughs> Alright, so we gotta deal with that. We have a fireball. And we have our good little blood mage for extra... Even though we don't really need it. Actually, I probably... No, we're not gonna use that yet. But we are going to... Get rid of him. So important. We're not gonna put Thanos. What we're gonna do is get rid of him because he's sticky. So that way, next turn, if he floods the board, we will uh, have some answers. So, obviously, I'm not off to the great start I was last time. Actually, a blizzard would probably be pretty good right now, but uh, I think we're going to... Yeah, we're definitely going to do a uh, flame strike. Alright, so, as you can see, Zoo is tough. Problem is, he still gets a 1-1 one -one on board, but that's far better than... Uh, than what he had before. Now next turn, it depends what he does. Blizzard will probably come in handy. If he floods the board a lot, I'm gonna probably do another um I'm gonna do another uh I'm not gonna do flame strike for that. But I will actually do this little cool combo, so that on So, then we got, still got another Flame Strike in hand and another one in the deck. Um, I'm probably going to play um, Arcanitis and obviously Frost. And then we will... What is he doing? Really, dude? This guy's obviously setting up lethal, but uh, we have a hopefully we'll slow him down. And we have a lot of power in our hands, so unless well, he pr if, if he did that uh, soul fire, it means he probably has uh, some tricks up his sleeve. But uh, we shall see. <laughs> wow, really, dude? Oh wow, so he he actually wow, talk about random and getting uh, and of course he has bad manners as well too, right? I really hate the bad manners. Matter of fact, I should send him a tell. But uh, yeah, he got lucky there. So 
Anyways, a win and a loss. I hope you guys enjoy it. Zoo can be pretty devastating, and that uh, match showed it. He got a lot some random randomness in his corner, but anyways, take care, guys.